I wonder if the others are doing okay. Yeah, we split up with them back there. No prob! Those guys know how to handle themselves. Anyway, let's just go! The enemy Mike is up ahead. Rachel, I'm counting on you. Gonna give up here. So, where's Mike? I think beyond that door. It's finally time. Yes. Final battle. Everyone ready? Yeah. I'm ready whenever. <laughs> Impressive. To come this far unawakened? I myself it's a miracle. You can't go beyond this point. Unless you defeat me, you won't be able to see now. I guess we'll have to force our way in. <laughs> I wouldn't try that if I were you. There's no way you can beat me the way you are now. What did you say? You made the wrong choice. If you had gone down the right path, this dream would have changed. What do you mean? Oh, what you want to do? But there's no point in even telling me. Because your history is about to end. 
right here, right now! Shut your trap! We'll see about that! If we all work together, the Go-Getters Club can do anything! Come on, everyone! Let's do this! Okay. <laughs> Something cool written there, right? But this... This isn't my name. I am servant of you. That is the essence of this game. What's displayed on your wristband is for someone else. Someone else's task. Only the first person to finish their task will receive a reward. Let's say person A finishes their task before anyone else. <coughs> then, only person A will get a reward. However, none of you know your own task, right? That's why, to get the reward, you have to get whoever has your task to show it to you. Or even, take it by force. Even if that means someone gets hurt. What a weird show.
here with this weird bracelet on. Ugh, I feel like my head is going to explode! Hey, Rachel! Just calm down! I'm the leader here, and I got it under control! Just do like I say, and I promise you, everything will be okay! We were on our field trip to Kamakura. On that bus. Then a meteor fell from the sky. I don't remember anything after that. I wonder if the shockwave from the meteor strike somehow sent us flying. It's a flyer for World's End Land. This undersea theme park. The grand opening was supposed to be last year, but it was cancelled. I heard they just abandoned the whole thing for some reason. I don't know who. But I'd say we've been taken by some seriously dangerous people. We'd be smart not to get them mad. We should just do whatever they say. Seriously, what the hell is this? What the hell are we doing here? Rachel, are you behind all of this? helps keep me thinking more clearly. Hey! Everyone seems a little different somehow. Your spiritual waves. Everyone's aura seems to be really dark. I hope we're going to be okay. Whoa! Rachel, are you okay? What are we gonna do now? We've, like, totally got to get out of here! Listen, everyone. We can't just sit around here. We need to get above ground. Forget that! You can't get above ground! You're all trapped in this underwater theme park! We saw you in that movie, on the bus! Be alone! That's right! So glad you remembered me! The name's Pielope. Hang on tight, cause you're all going to play a little game of fate for me! Game of fate? A game for your very lives! The rules are simple. It's all right here in the rule book. Go ahead and read it for me. The devices on your arms, they're called wristbands. 
On the wristbands are tasks or missions that you have to do. But those aren't your own tasks. They're other people's tasks. And the person wearing a wristband with your task is called your task mate. The first person to complete their task is the sole winner. The winner will be rewarded with a magic key. The time limit is one hour. If there's no winner when time is up, everyone loses. Task game? That's just like the movie, too. <laughs> Some of you airheads can't remember anything. So I made the rules nice and clear for you. Well, pretty easy, right? <sighs> What's a magic key? It says here that that's what the winner gets. It's a key that can open anything with a keyhole. Like a master key. Of course, it could even open the door to the surface. Like I said, you're all trapped in this underwater theme park. Without that key, none of you can get out. One thing though, the key can only be used once. So better make sure you don't waste it on the door to the bathroom or something. The first thing you all need to figure out is what your task is. Unless you know that, you've got no way of winning this game. So somehow, you've got to find a way to see the wristbands that show your task. However you want to get that done, it's up to you. You can take a peek at your taskmate's wristband, or try to make a deal with them. But, the easiest way would be to find your taskmate and get rid of them, don't you think? Anyway, enough talk. We'd better get this thing started. Well, actually, it already has started. <laughs> You've already used up three minutes, so better get a move on. Hey, hang on, you! What makes you think we'll play? Yeah, we're not playing some game of fate. Oh, you'll play. You'll definitely play. Because if you lose... for you to follow. You either win the game, or you get processed by the sludge bot! Every man for himself. Self-defense is all about who strikes first. Rachel, I think we better do what that Pielope says. Yeah, not much choice. B well, if you all feel that way, same for me! Rachel, I know how you feel, but we really don't have a choice. Totally. Like, I don't want to do it either, but... Yippee! This is awesome! Everybody's on board! I'm so excited! Cool then. 
let's make this a nice, juicy, splatterific fate game no one will forget. Yellow Loon! Task meet. Does anyone know what Chuko's task is? What's the point of even asking? No one here is stupid enough to tell the truth. Yeah, and what about Mochan? What should we do about him? If Mochan got a look at his taskmate's wristband, then... <sighs> that weasel! They're all so dumb. In this game, info is what it's all about. And they don't have a clue. Hey, Rachel, I got a good plan. How about we team up? Only one person can win this game. But Pielope never said we can't work together. Listen, I'm counting on you. You and me will work together until it's just us two. After that, you can win and get the magic key. You don't have to worry about me. That creepy robot, that sludge bot, isn't gonna get its stinking paws on me. Hurry up and get over here. We'll show each other our wristbands to seal the deal, okay? What's the deal? Hurry up! We show our wristbands as a... That's the spirit. Hey, I just said that info is what it's all about in this game, right? The thing is, the only one who's gonna get the info now is me. Man, you're gullible. You shouldn't be so trusty. I thought you were smart. It's why I wanted to take you out first, but it looks like I had you all wrong. What's the deal? Hurry up! We show our wristbands as... Damn! He's too smart. I gotta take him out before he becomes a problem. Yo, Mochan! So you got no idea what your task is, huh? N no I don't! How would I know that? In that case, let me see that wristband of yours! What do you mean in that case? I don't see the connection! Everyone, listen to me. I have a proposal. Proposal? Let's just not do it, okay? This game of fate. What do you mean? You know I'm the daughter of a scientist, right? So I looked at it logically and realized... Competing against each other isn't to our advantage. <sighs> We're suspicious of each other because we don't know each other's tasks. So in that case, we should all just be open and show our wristbands. Show our wristbands? Tatsun, you know me, right? Huh? Me? We're friends, right? And friends should trust each other. Y yeah but... Then let's start by showing each other our wristbands. But but Don't worry. We'll show at the same time. That would be fair, right? Uh... Okay. All right then. One, two... Hey, on your wristband, that's my task. It says, don't show your wristband until six minutes before the time limit. But that means...
Well, that's one down. Yikes! Nyoro is super sneaky! And skinny little four eyes, Tatsun, is officially out of the game! Officially... out? Didn't you hear what Tatsun just said? Tatsun's task was, don't show your wristband until six minutes before the time limit. But he showed it to Nyoro, so... Yep, c'est la vie. Nyoro knew that, so that's why she made him show it. So what happened to Tatsun? He got tossed into that robot. <laughs> He's probably just a thick, pasty sludge now. Bye-bye now. That's the end of my explanation. Piano Noon! Oh. Nyoro, what's the deal with you? You've got some kind of complaint? The normal Nyoro would never have done that. What do you expect? This isn't exactly a normal situation. Nyoro. Listen up! Everybody, I got Rachel's task on my wristband. Rachel's task is to touch someone on the back. Huh? Anaki? Why would you... I need everybody's help. That's why I'm sharing what I know. Touch someone on the back? What kind of lame task is that? That's too easy. He could win this whole thing in a flash. Yeah. True. How about we all work together? So we can take out Rachel. Only one person can win this game. If Rachel touches anyone's back, we'll all lose. Yeah, and we'll get dumped in that robot. No, not that! Anything but that! Yeah, so to stop that, we gotta take out Rachel first. Everybody ready? Yup. Give it up, Rachel! Don't let him escape! <laughs> that went well. I'll just let them take each other out for me.
going to attack you, Rachel. Oh, Pochi. Vanilla. Pochi came from that way? Yeah. The outer hallways are shaped like a big donut. Are you serious? You're still playing your dumb old game? This calms me down. By the way, I have a favor to ask, Rachel. Can you come here? Okay, go ahead. Huh? Ah! Just as I expected. What's the deal? Oh, I get it. That means Rachel's task wasn't to touch someone on the back. My big bro was lying. How dare he? Even if he is my real brother. In fact, it's because he is my real brother that I'm so mad. But maybe it's not his fault. Like the others, he didn't seem to be his normal self. Now that I think of it, everyone was acting a bit weird. Maybe something strange happened inside those pods. Something strange? You know, like brainwashing or something like that. Brainwashing? But what for? To force us to participate in this game of fate, of course! Anyway, it seems like the three of us here are still thinking logically. So that means there's only one thing for us to do. We should work together to win the game of fate. What? So to do that, we should show each other our wristbands. Wait just a second! You're kidding me, right? No. And you haven't been brainwashed? I'm totally fine. <sighs> Come on, Vanilla. Show me your wristband. You think I'm gonna say sure? Just like that? Tatsun just showed his wristband, and he... Here you go. Aniki's task. Eliminate everyone besides yourself? This is Tatsun's wristband. I picked it up after he dropped it a minute ago. I guess something makes the wristband come off once the person is eliminated. Concise task. Don't bleed until seven minutes before the time limit. See? Do you get it now? You won't end up like Tatsun if you show us your wristband. But Rachel still hasn't shown us what his wristband says. What do you mean? You're not going to show us? I see. So no negotiations, huh? What? That's not fair, Vanilla. Why? You were the one that showed it to me. Ugh. I'm sorry. It's not that I don't trust you two. But I can't show you my wristband no matter what. Anyway, good luck, you guys. <laughs> See ya! Vanilla. Well, that's it. There goes my strategy. It didn't seem like Vanilla had been brainwashed, so I thought she'd show her wristband. Well, it is what it is, I guess. Only one thing to do now. Keep everyone from doing their tasks. Rachel, I noticed something over here. Let's keep on poking around. Exit. So this must be the way out. But we need a key to open it. But I bet the magic key would work. Maybe if we entered a password in the panel. You'd be in trouble! 
careful if I got eliminated, right? So you better help me for your own good. Or do you want to end up like Tot soon? <sighs> Fine. I'll help. I knew you're a smart one, Yoro. Oh, Rachel's here! And Pochi, too! Two boys against two girls? This isn't good. And if Rachel touches either of us on the back, we're done. We'd better get out of here. Yeah, let's go! So those two teamed up, huh? We better be careful. Something odd about this door. It won't open. There's no keyhole, but it has an input panel with numbers. I wonder what the passcode is. No point in it. As long as we don't have the passcode, it won't open. Hey. Makes sense. Wait! I'm not gonna let you do it! That sounds like Kansai. Let's go! Looks like this drawbridge can be raised and lowered by pressing the button. I, I told you to let go! I'm almost there! Why would I let go? Rachel! Oh no! He's gonna touch our backs! No, Kansai. Aniki was just making that up. Like I'd believe that! Anyway, I got bigger problems! This is what happens to anyone in my way! Sh shut up! We gotta hurry! Wh what's going on? M mo chan He saw my wristband! mo chans task is on my wristband! What's his task? Ah! Uh, no use hiding it now! Ride the Ferris wheel one time in the red gondola! That's Mochan's task! That's why I need to destroy the Ferris wheel's power system! Ugh. Cut it out! Don't worry, I will! Once the Red Gondola gets here, we're done for if Mochan gets on the Ferris wheel! We've got no choice! Pochi! Rachel! Destroy the Ferris Wheel's power system for me! That way, Mochan won't be able to do his task, and he'll be eliminated! Stop it! I don't want to die! There are so many things I still want to eat! Hurry! Before the Red Gondola gets here! We can't let Mochan finish his task. Come on, let's break the power system.
I guess we should destroy the power system. But how do we do that? Hey. It doesn't look like we can open it from here. We made it in time. Ah. Mochan has been eliminated. What? what is it this time? That's... Hey ya! Enjoying the game? You! Hmm. I was gonna go ahead and give you some useful info. But if you're going to be rude, forget about it. What do you mean, useful info? Didn't I just tell you to forget about it since you were rude? I wouldn't tell you now. Even if you prized my mouth open, I won't tell you you can see the faces of the eliminated people right on the monitor. Oops. Uh, uh. Anyway, I guess I let it slip. I'm expecting a nice, lively battle! Don't let me down! Yellow Lagoon! So Chugo and Yoro have been eliminated. Now that Mochan is out, the truce ends here. Huh. But two versus one is bad news. Time for a quick retreat! Oh, so that's how it is. Chuko's task was, protect the park's facilities until eight minutes before the time limit. That makes sense, since we destroyed the Ferris wheel just now. But why was Nioro eliminated? Well, no point worrying about that now. Let's go, Rachel. No way. Now those two have teamed up together? Nyoro and Chuko teamed up? I didn't see that coming. This is the wristband that Chuko dropped. Let's see what it says. Hmm. Nyoro's task. Go down the slide with Chuko? Chuko must have shown this to Nioro, and then threatened her. Something like, if I get taken out, you're a goner too. Because if Chuko got eliminated, she wouldn't be able to ride down the slide with her. So that meant, if Chuko is gone, then Nioro wouldn't have a chance either. That's how Chuko got Nioro to help, although she planned on betraying her later. Nioro knew that Chuko would betray her. But she had no choice but to go along with it. So then, they were going around together, but Chuko got eliminated. And then Nyoro couldn't complete her task. Oh, oh, I see. Amazing, 
Kaneki, you saw through everything. Do you have a sixth sense like I do? No. And even if I did, nobody can see through everything. Well, true, but... I was the one that gave Chuko the idea. That's how I know. I guess for Nero, Chuko is also in the way. So she died early. Damn you, Aniki. Well, that's that. Time for plan B. Right, let's go! What does he mean by plan B? Let's follow him and see. Hey, 